could do that. Yeah. Oh, do you know, do you ever like write something and then it's like your crush poem, you have a crush on it, so you want to read it like everywhere you go, right? So um, we've talked about some of the wild things people say to me, right? Um, so that inspired a lot of this poem. Um, so uh, it's still like, it's officially still Martin Luther King Day weekend. I think I can just kind of keep this one and we're just gonna, I'm gonna make an excuse for it. Like next month is Black History Month. You know, March is just cause I fucking feel like it. It's gonna be, <laughs> it's gonna be what it is um, all the time. Cause this is part of my life all the time. And so I wanna read this poem everywhere I go. Um, it's how I wanna introduce myself to new people on the subway. Um, this is called Black Rage in Four Part Harmony. One, I am easy black, indie black, light black, like black light, your black friend, so cliche, your only black employee, want me to be your soundtrack, want me to be your ghostwriter, want me to give you permission, want to touch my hair, want to end of summer compare skin tones, I always lose, still blacker than you, you will follow me through the store, offer to hold my things at the counter until I am ready to check out, but you will still ride the elevator and you will probably not clutch your purse. I listen to gangster rap loud with the windows down when I drive through your neighborhood cause fuck you. I have stolen your boyfriends on purpose or at least glances from them to shame you. I have balled up my tongue into Gatling gung, spit sour nickels into a sack and hit you with it. It never lashes the same way as nigger no matter how hard I whip my words. Two. My grandmother instructed us all hard molasses the first time strangers referred to us as Negro children. It was a word we had not heard before. Around this house, we are black. She spoke easy as hot comb smoking, smooth blue magic, sharp surprise of burnt ears and stinging sit stills. Around our Sunday afternoon table, we used to smile into each other's black faces. We laughed magnificent black and loved each other with an unbreakable blackness. We blacked music and ate to its rhythm, blacked mismatched dishes, blacked each other's hair and fingernails, blacked double dutch and song, blacked bicycles harder and faster than the whole neighborhood, blacked wrong and right answers, blacked yes please, blacked no thank you, blacking only the most delicious black, all the time blacking. My mother still wants to believe that I could white the same way, a flash of teeth, a sprinkle of freckle. I tell her that most white people only want me white when they want to win an argument. Strangers still ask me sometimes what I am. They often preface the question with, I mean, I can see you have some black in you. I laugh blackly, not minding the question so much as their expectation of an answer. I am the end of the pool that no one is afraid of until the bottom drops out. Sometimes this light skin gets me invited to parties that I am not really welcome at. Three. Why you so mad? Why you so mad? Why you got a chip on your shoulder? Why you so mad? Why you can't just swallow stones till you stop being hungry? Why you can't just smile? Why you can't just dance? Why you can't just drink? Why you can't just forget your name, his name, their names? I mean, we made you an exception. We let you slide. We might even let you pass. So why you got to be so mad? Why you got your chest puffed up after we put the fire hoses away? Why you can't just shake your head and suck your teeth and look to your own and forget that everybody is your own? Why why you can't just keep it pushing, why you can't just shuck, why you can't just shrug, why you can't just laugh, we were only joking, all present company excluded all, but you're not like that, Susie, I mean, all I said was ghetto, all I said was ratchet, all I said was nappy, why you can't just relax, why you can't just press and curl, why you can't just pop your booty, why you can't just twerk, why you can't just drop it, everybody's dropping it, why you can't just burn slow at both ends quiet, why you gotta explode all shrapnel in my eye, why you so mad, why you so mad, why you so mad, mad why are you so black for there are three basic ways to make a noose the first is to run the tail of the rope through a fixed loop the second and most common way is to tie a simple knot round the standing part of the rope. When pulled, the knot side closes the loop, the heel of a hand pressed against an easy throat, a gate left foolishly swinging open. The third is the same as the second, except that pulling the knot will open the loop like the string on a yo-yo. This is usually only done by mistake. 
This is not a promise, only finger and thumb unraveling, a tongue tying and untying, interlaced fingers and knots. It is hushed whispers over a fledgling tree that everyone knows was watered with blood except, of course, the tree wonders why her arms grow out so snatching, why she shake them loose when they fool enough to climb, menacing into her afro leaves, why everyone knows she is too hungry a place for their children to swing. Black people, once freed, did not gather in mobs and hunt, despite all the same access to trees and rope. <laughs> 